Hey guys, Crew Blind Levi I'm Merrick. I'm Rick. I'm Calvin. I'm Aaron. And we're here with another movie reaction. This time we're reacting to Eric. Uh, Rick. Aaron. Calvin. And we are here reacting Ruined to... <laughs> uh, this is an uh, anime movie called Your Name. Uh, I have no idea what that means. I was just told to put it on a poll, and then it won. So Anime? Yeah. I thought this was live. Here? Out. Yeah. Jeez. We've watched anime movies in the Oh, yeah. Past. This is pretty good. Akira. I like that. Akira. I'm not All quite right, sure what go. happened in that movie, but it was interesting. It was really interesting. It goes in the show. Really in the show with uh, it. This is going to be a little different take. Um, okay. We're leaving the realm of the... The weird? Of the weird, maybe. Mm -hmm. Oh, cool. Leaving the realm? Maybe oh. not. I was say, Akira did some... There was some, I'm not quite sure. I need to watch that game because I don't know if I understood what happened. There was some and weird audience. The show was like, I, I think I got most of it, but I'm like, man, there's some like deep themes and stuff in this one where Akira, I'm just kind of like, I don't know. This movie is, is uh, it's much newer than those. It's a romance. Oh. And it's one I've been waiting to see for a long time. I've been holding off just for this moment. Ooh, hmm. Real romance anime. I feel like the most important question then is what color is her hair? Takes why place is in that, Japan. Why is that the most important question? Who cares? Remember. Oh, hey, before we get started, uh, you, if you have a copy of this movie, you want to watch the entire reaction with us, we do offer that over at our Patreon. Uh, full length, check that out over there. Um, also, uh, these movie reactions get voted uh, by the good people over at Patreon, so every two weeks, they let us know what they want us to watch. So, if you want to get on that action, you can go there as well. Now we'll start. That's beautiful. Clouds. Something's falling from the sky. Rick, you said this is a romance. Something's falling from the sky. Yeah, love! This is a superhero horror. Love, look out! It's not base seven. Love, America. Cast me here. All right, well, we're four shots in, and I can already tell it's going to be beautiful. Hmm. Maybe the dragons are coming. Taki. Taki. Don't you remember? <laughs> My name is... Mitsuha! <gasps> Let's see why this is voted in. That light was so much higher. It's like, what's going on? Rick? I think someone. I think you lied to me, Rick. I think you lied. I said it's a. You lied! You said it was a romantic comedy. Grandma? You can. With Ryan Reynolds. With no weird shit. Where's Ryan Reynolds? Morning. A comet that comes only once every 1200 years will finally be headed our way in a month. Miyamizu. Yeah, yes! Well, I can see that you remember your own name today. <laughs> mm -hmm. You don't remember me? Something happened to her. Your name. Someone, t something took her over. World's oldest kind of sake. Chewing on rice, spitting it out, and then letting it ferment naturally, it becomes alcohol. I never do that. And in front of everybody. Embarrassing, right? So the, hmm. You got bacteria in your mouth. I don't think I want alcohol anymore. Mix it in with the rice. It's not any kind of alcohol you've had. <laughs> what kind of alcohol is it? Sake. I had sake. Not that kind of sake. But you'd like it for her. Would rather have that or her hair was red? Like people stop the grapes with their feet. Sometimes falling in, falling on their ass with the grapes. Taking the feet. I hate this town! I hate this life too! Please make me a handsome Tokyo boy in my next life! <sighs> what a jackass. <laughs> <Right>. <laughs> Okay. So they're trading bodies. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Something's there. <laughs> <laughs> what is it? It is the morning. It's kind of hard to ignore. 
You got lost. Yeah. Wait a second. How'd you wind up getting lost on the way to school? I believe. Well, a girl. A girl? A, a gal. Hmm? A gal. <laughs> I mean, uh, a guy. <laughs> <laughs> you know, guys just want to have fun. Want to hit the cafe <laughs> later? <laughs> oh, that one? Sure. You in, Taki? What? 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 Uh, a cafe? Little <laughs> 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 They've got nice timber work in here. They just ate. Yeah, it's pretty intricate. Waiter. Hey, you. Uh, yes? See this? Does it look right? The toothpick's in it. Uh, what would have happened if we ate it? I don't even think we have toothpicks at this What? Place. <laughs> Excuse me. Is everything all right over here? Well, like I'll I was trying to tell the guy. <laughs> Your meal is on the house tonight. Why, thank you. What happened to his cheek? You weren't hurt, were you? <laughs> what was that? It was a box over. So I thought too, but what was the... Miss Ogodera, your skirt. Oh, Are you all right? Got her skirt. Did something yeah. happen? Looks like someone cut it. <laughs> that guy. Really what now? Do you remember what he looked like? No. Come with me. Uh, huh? All done. Wow. Ta-da! Sonic. <laughs> You're really good, Taki. It's way cuter now. <laughs> <laughs> Write your address, phone number, something. Right? I am handle. I am handle. Instant messenger. No, I know. <laughs> when was this made? <laughs> Are they traveling through time? <laughs> what? Wait a second, was that you, Tsukasa? Were you the one that's been messing with my phone? Huh? Uh, never mind. Later. Well, he's back to normal. I think he was kind of cute yesterday. Cute. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> Don't slack off today, you guys. Yeah. We're gonna have a good day today. Aren't we, Taki? No! Could this mean that we're really yep. that we're in our Back dreams, that guy and I that we're in our dreams, that girl and I <gasps> We're switching places? Alright, next episode. Next episode. <laughs> <laughs> oh no. Don't get that look off her face! <laughs> Every morning. Two or three times a week, I'll suddenly and randomly switch with Mitsuha, mm. who's somewhere out in the booth. Oh, the trigger Two or three is times sleep. A week. a week. Cause is unknown. Stop wasting my money on sweets. It's going in your body. Plus, I also work for that money. Breaking cords is impossible. You work way too many shifts. Because you keep wasting money. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know who this is. Yeah, uh huh? Okay. So which one is? I shouldn't for her sake. Uh, oh, okay. Bye. Now that you know that's not the dream. Ah, that was great. Oh my gosh. Tying strings together is a union. Connecting to people is a union. And the flow of time is a union. They twist, tangle. Unravel now and then, break, and reconnect. That's what a union is. What time is. Cool. It's in a crater. Uh -huh. Oh, yeah. Maybe I can see the comet. Huh? The comet? Oh. Mitsuha. You're dreaming right now, aren't you? Oh, wow. Yeah. Oh, that'd be terrifying. Date? <laughs> They've probably
probably met up about now. Plays a dog go on its voice. What happened to her hair? Your hair. I guess it's weird. Huh. Is it causing the wind? <laughs> uh oh. Oh, catch Calcifer. If it hits you in the face, that'd be terrible, right? In the face? Yeah. Anywhere? Yeah. <laughs> if it hits? Yeah. What's going on? Oh shit. She got blown up and her phone's destroyed. No, I think that he, she's there. The switches Mitsuha and I had been going through until now, they never happened again. Oh shit, maybe you're right. Oh, this is what I come to anime movies for. He taunted? Yep. Let me take a look. Okay, thanks. Itamori. Itamori was. Oh no. Wait. That's where. Isn't that the area where that comet. Oh. She did. Oh. Jesus. Wow. Fuck. This was the place. This schoolyard. These mountains, even this high school here, I remember it all. There's no way you could. You've got to know about that disaster three years ago, three right? Three years ago. Hundreds of people died. died. They died. Are they gone? <laughs> They're changing. They're, They're deleting. Racing. What the hell? Finding the name she's of looking, the dead. She's looking for the name of the dead, or he is. Yeah. Can we find her name? Tashi Kawara and Sayaka. They were both involved in. Huh? That's her? Just two or three weeks ago, she said that I'd be able to see the comet. That means. You're dreaming right now. Why, aren't you? I... Rick, I don't know what you think when you think romantic comedy. He didn't say, didn't say comedy. comedy. You, you said Ryan Reynolds, I know it. You said that. I remember it. That band on your wrist. That's one, isn't it? Huh? Oh, this thing? Guess so. Somebody... Someone gave it to me. I wear it sometimes as kind of a lucky Who charm. gave it to you? They assemble and take shape. They twist, tangle, unravel now and then. Break and reconnect. That's what a union is. What time is. It's really there. It wasn't a dream. Musubi. If it's true, and time can be unraveled, just give me one more chance. Life. Your name's going to be Mitsuha. I'm so sorry, my dears. Get a hold of yourself. 
Who cares about the shrine? But you're in charge now. I loved Futaba, not Miyamizu Shrine. Get out! Why am I? I'm going to Tokyo. What? Wait, Zach! What? Grandma, would you mind doing me a favor? Oh yeah, the comet. Mitsuha, run! Mitsuha! So she was gonna go to Tokyo? Well, she ah. said that before too, right? Where's the back? Did she experience that in his mind? I don't know. Yeah, I think so. Movies? I don't know what day we're on. Huh? Wait, so he's, he's back. He's her? Let me guess, you're touching your boot. <gasps> Oh my god. They kick me every time! <laughs> I'm like, surely not this time! Oh, uh, he's, he's sad because she's gonna. <laughs> every time! I, I know, I'm like, oh man, he's not gonna be doing it this time. And he is! For her sake. I got it! <laughs> she's alive! Oh. Treasure the experience. Dreams eventually will fade away. I went through similar times myself, and so did your mother. Ah. What if all those dreams that the Miyamizu people had, it had to do with today? Nobody's gonna believe that? I didn't expect that out of Mita's grandma. <laughs> it doesn't matter. There's no way I'm gonna let them all die. Yotaha, promise me that you'll leave town with grandma before dark. What? You're gonna die if you stay here! What are you talking about? Oh, and why did you suddenly go to Tokyo yesterday? You've been acting really strange lately! I went to Tokyo yesterday. Yeah, I know. Went to Tokyo. Tokyo! Is she waking up in him? <laughs> yeah, but oh my gosh, years different. from Taki again! Yep. She doesn't grab his dick every day. But what was Taki that. doing out here? She looks down and she blushes every morning. True. Mm -hmm. I guess we won't meet. It's, it's a different time, right? Well, at this time, she didn't know that. Right? No. Right. But in the opening, we saw them meet each other on the train. So if she comes here now, then he won't recognize her. It hasn't happened to him yet, and she's probably the person that gave him the bracelet. Yeah, maybe. Someone gave it to me, I don't know who. So they met three years ago, but he doesn't remember. She doesn't know who he is. Or vice versa. Yeah. Taki. Huh? Uh, it's me. Don't you remember? Uh, sorry, who are you? What's your name? Mitsuha! My name is Mitsuha! Good day in the episode. There's another episode in here, there, yeah. Thank God I don't have to wait. <laughs> right? <laughs> right? I don't know what the hell's going on right now. They're in each other's bodies. And they're here. They're in different times. Yeah. They're hearing the yells through time. <laughs> oh, someone went ding. Union! The strings. Ooh. Oh, this is cool with the sunlight. Taki, are you? Are you there? Damn. I don't know why I thought it was going to work. You can grab her out of time? Yeah, it'll be amazing. <laughs> Barry Allen did it to Iris one time. Really here? 
Uh. Well, I drank some of your kuchi kamizaki. <laughs> my rice spit? Stupid pervert! What? what? Yeah, that's right. You were touching my boobies, weren't you? What? Well, how do you even? Cause Yota saw you. I just, I couldn't help myself. <laughs> but it was just the one time. One time. Just the one time. Every time. Here. I kept it for three years. But I think it's time you got it back. Hey, Mitsuha. You still have a lot to do. Listen. It's coming. Don't worry. You still have enough time. Let's write down our names. Here. <sighs> Did he just get a line? Yeah. <sighs> Hurry, write it. Write it on your hand. The line's already gone. Who are you? And what did I even come here for? I'll tell you what, this shit better work out. I know. Domestic terrorism! Jeez, man. Broadcast club. <laughs> Did I hear that right? Wildfires are possible, as well as the threat of more explosions. This is the end. Oh, oh my god. It's actually splitting apart. You still get the hell out of there. something out of a dream. Nothing more or less than a breathtaking view. Jesus. I mean, she wasn't on the hillside. No, right? Well, she was no. in a different spot, but I don't... And we saw the names of her two friends, but not her family. But we saw her name. Yeah, I know, but she's cha the, that changed. She did die on the hillside. Now she's with her parents. Or her dad. A fragment of the comet destroyed a town in that disaster. But miraculously, most of the people living in the town were unhurt. Uh. The town happened to be holding an emergency drill that day. And most of us residents were outside the impact zone. Mm -hmm. hmm. If it's snowing, well, it's always important when it's snowing. Snow, like, <laughs> the, the, the snow is important. Bling <laughs> 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 bling. She doesn't remember his name. Son of a bitch. <sighs> I guess they're all alive. Good for them. Just a little more. Just a little more. beside each other? Yeah. I was always searching. Searching for someone. What happened? Jeez, I thought the train crashed or something. Jeez, like, what's, Aaron. what's happening? No, it's just a tunnel diverging. Find like, her! Thud! Find <laughs> her! Jesus. God, just still okay. dead. Run down the street, man! Come on. Yeah. Now he's walking all nice and calm. <laughs> I get it, I get that. <laughs> hey, what's up? Hey. Wait, do I know you? Wait, what? They don't want, they don't want to be crazy. Can, Can I, I ask, ask you, you your, your name? name? Hey, Kratz! In the movie! Yeah! Good! <laughs> Fuck! Why'd you have a 
I don't have to believe there's an ending. So many endings have happened already. <laughs> wait, wait, me, who the thing was gonna happen? And then they died. <laughs> Another comet hits. Is that probably it, you think? Yeah. No, I have to do that after credit scenes. Yeah, you got credit scenes on these things. A lot, there's a lot of time here. Watch Psych next, though. 41. I mean, there's I mean, a lot of animation on this movie. Oh, yeah. It was there's gorgeous. Four, four four and a half to see minutes it. left. <laughs> oh, man. That was real good. I, I figured there would be nothing after the credits because you pretty much you, you do your whole story to get to that point. To do your title and then do credits. You don't yeah, want to do anything I don't think you're going to give it no, an after thing or anything, but... I feel like anything after that would just detract from it. Yeah, no, Rick, the Ocelot's going to call in. And... Fantastic. Rick, you told me there was nothing weird about this thing. Well... <laughs> the romantic so, comedy, right? Well, I said it was a romance, and I stopped short of saying, well, at least it's not sci-fi, because I knew there was body swapping. Oh. And I knew okay. that it was a romantic movie, and I knew it was heartwarming. And the last thing that was recommended to me that was heartwarming is one of the saddest things I've ever seen. Yeah. So I was afraid that this was going to have a sad ending, too. Yeah. Well, yeah, I mean, I spent most of the time being like, is it going to make it? Or but not? The, the heartwarming you know, all of my warm, hot Did tears you? are dripping down my face. When, I, chest, when, when, I, when I put things in the poll, I usually look up, like, the date they came out or the year they came out, and it usually says, like, you know, the genre. And it said romance. So I was like, oh, okay. Well, that could be cool. Maybe it's just really well done. Maybe the animation's real good, you know? And it was. Yeah. But, now, but, I've yeah. seen romances that the are... The story was fantastic. You know... I don't know, anything from serendipity to fifty yeah. first dates to well, I mean to the lake house. You know what I mean? Yeah, the like, lake house is the thing I thought of. With, in, in, at one point in this, when they were doing, like, is that like a lake house? Like the lake house. Yeah, that's part of my thought. Yeah. And like whenever they had the line that was like, you know, if, it was when she was in the in the cafe and she's looking at the prices or whatever. Yeah. It's like I could live for a, I don't know, a decade or whatever she said. Like on, the, on these prices. Yeah, something like that. And you know? said yeah, a decade ago. Yeah. And I'm like, oh man, is there some kind of like time mm -hmm. difference? You know, and things have gone up more and. I was like, I don't, I don't know. Well, you're always calling out time, time, time shenanigans anyway. There's time shenanigans and, and everything. And you're off the wrong. Well, <laughs> I don't know about that. We'll go back in time and find out. But. Yeah, it was a lot of like similar themes to Steins Gate as well. Mm. Like just trying to use time to save someone that you care yeah. about. I like. I mean, there's lots of things that they kind of they seeded and brought around with a few things. You know, like they had the. Uh, I don't know, there's still something that I don't really know. I mean, like, they seed it enough with, like, the rope thing, I guess, of, like, time's also like a rope, and it can ravel yeah. and tangle and all that kind of stuff, too. And, like, they they had things with the grandma saying, me and your your mom also had weird dreams. We don't yeah. remember any of them now. And I'm like, what? what? Well, how's that happen? What happens? Yeah. Is, is it the family? You know, is that what causes mm -hmm. it? It's the bloodline that takes care of the shrine. Well, yeah, did, did well, they... They... Sure, but why do they have these dream things? Well, because... Is there some relation to that stuff in the fire that occurred that made him forget what happened, and, you know? like Yeah, so, I mean, uh, I think that family has been, like, the caretaker of the priestesses to that god for a long time. So he speaks through them, would be my assumption. The Maya yeah, Goro. And they also said, like, all of this was for this moment, too, right? Like, there might be something, too, like, that, you know, because the comet came and it was the destruction that you know caused this but also the comet might have caused it's the salvation of those people too you know yeah. at the end of the day you know because in one version they died and the other version they didn't maybe there's something tied to the comet as well that like reaches back in time well and maybe the god tried to do all this when the first comet hit too mm -hmm. yeah but, like it didn't work out or, or it did work out and like well yeah because like there's something there like like that first lake thing is like a crater Looks like a good like a, yeah. like it just looks like the same one that happened the next time. Now the other one with the, the it's not a shrine. Was it a shrine? The it's thing shrine. They, they left a thing to. Yeah. Yeah. Like that kind of looked like a crater, but it was I don't know. Maybe there's like something about that area that summons. It was also like on a mountain top. Yeah. Yeah, it's up on a mountain too. Well, and like it's possible multiple little bits split and one of them hit yeah. one place. Well, in the one shot, we saw, like, da 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 Yeah. Like, there's, like, lots of little hits, it looked like. And then the next one, we saw, like, just a big, like... I tell you what, the uh, the actual impact of the comet was a beautifully done scene. Yeah, it was. That was amazing. Like, just removing, <coughs> like, that, you know, leading up to it and then removing everything and then just, you know, so good. I really like the scene, too, where they were, like, traveling through that weird time 
realm. Yeah, when he's like the seeing string. her life. Yeah, and like just showing the birth and the cutting of the cord. It reminds me a lot of Death Stranding as well. It has a lot of that mm. imagery and that talk of like, well, a strand can mean so many things. It can like tie things together. It is also like related with time and birth and all these different things. And someone being stranded is someone being like separated. Yeah. But mm. strands can also tie things together mm -hmm. as well. You know? So it's, I wonder if one of these was influenced by the other, you know? Like this was 2016, Death Stranding was after that. I wonder when he started like writing yeah. that. If there's any influence on both those, or if there's maybe there's a, a third element that influenced both. Sure. Yeah. Yeah, like yeah. parallel thinking. Yeah, this could be like, you know, a religious or folklore idea in Japan or something that ties yeah. it all together. Uh, I mean, just to get out of the way, this is the quality of the animation and art design. I mean, it's a movie, so they're going to have way more, a lot more money and uh, time. Time is the big thing in anime, I know, because like they're pumping this stuff out in a week. Um, yeah. But what I, watching this, as opposed to something that I also find to be very well done, like The Promised Neverland, right? Promised Neverland goes into that 3D background and compositing and stuff, but and you could say, well, that's similar here, but the, the difference is is the way they do like 3D composite lighting is just way crazier in a movie like this. Like if you just like put the two shows beside each other, the way things are lit is I don't know how they do it. Like I have a rudimentary idea of how visual effects work. I don't know how they do that. Are they lit so different? It's like night and day. It's yeah. I mean, it's not like a day for night shot mm -hmm. <laughs> where it's like I can tell that's happening. You know, um, it's just like you know. If you have a candle in the room, like how much effort are you gonna go into in like truly animating the flicker and the drop off and stuff? And sometimes in a you know in a normal weekly anime, you just got like one line, you know, over skin tone. And or you can take the time to actually composite fifty layers to make that happen, you know, over a drawing. It's amazing. And like every shot just had so many details. Like yeah. there's so many things in each of their room, mm -hmm. and like you know a lot of that isn't really necessary, but it just makes it all feel real. Yeah. Mm -hmm. and yeah, I like, too, how um, there was a whole thing about, like, the cafe. And it was really just interesting seeing each of them better each other's lives mm -hmm. through, like, they had strengths that the other ones necessarily yeah. didn't have. And so they could, like, use that strength in the other's lives and help grow their life in a more positive direction. Yeah. And then they found each other eight years after the comet impact, right? So she had to wait five years, she had to wait eight years? Yeah. yeah. Like, it was already three years during his, mm -hmm. so he waited five, five more additional years, and yeah. it was eight years later. Okay. Because I, I love the way that they were, like, up on the mountain, like, their chemistry and stuff was great. Yeah. So they, mm -hmm. had, to, they uh, had to rebuild that, because they don't, ultimately, they don't remember those things, like that. I don't think they do. And I don't Unless think that, that stuff and I don't, comes back yeah. to them when they reunite. True. But if it never does, they're just going to have like a, I just have a really good feeling about this person, which yeah. is probably probably a better story see, anyway. But See, I'm curious on some of the stuff, like the idea of like why all the phone stuff got deleted, you know? Like some of that kind of stuff. I'm like, I don't know why this happened. Because like the note in her hand was still there, and like that was, a, I don't know. I mean, maybe that's a different thing. Yeah. Maybe digitally, like it just it fucked. You're standing over a magnet that attracts. It's a uh, attracts asteroids and <laughs> it deleted. Like it. A, yeah. I don't know. You know what I mean? Open time loop. Yeah. Open well, yeah. Maybe because, like, the stuff that she wrote on his hand, like that disappeared because she it was didn't. dead. She never wrote it. She wrote a line and it disappeared. I thought he. I thought it was switching of hands. I thought she went to write on his one hand, so then he, he used his hand that he wrote with, and it went, started to write, and he, he did. I thought he started to write a new one, not that it disappeared. But maybe it did. I'd have to watch again and see which hand she drew on. There's also the idea that it's possible that whoever uh, had the ribbon had a better hold on things. Maybe. Maybe. Because he had it for those three years, and then she had it since then. Uh, you want to talk about something that he had a hold of? That was the best thing in the movie. <laughs> <laughs> the because, best thing? No, it, it is, it because it's a good. magic trick. It is an utter magic, magic trick. It gives you all this stuff, and the first time I'm like, oh, yeah, that's what's going to happen. You know, it's actually the first clue that it's a different body, yeah. you know? Yeah, yeah. 
And then the second time, you're like, oh, yeah, of course. And then the third time, you're like, all right, it's, I, I get it. It's funny, you know? But every time it kept happening, I, you know, it would it would do that thing where it's like, well, he's like, I can't do that now. I respect you too much. Yeah. It's like, I, door slides <laughs> open. You know? You're like, ha ha, you know? You got me. But you ain't going to get me again. <laughs> and it's like, no, this is serious. Like, I got to save this person's life. Oh my God, she's still alive. We're here, whatever. I'm like, oh my gosh. She, and then when she opened it, she gave that look. Yeah. I'm like, you know, it must yeah. be because of all this. You know, what, yeah. like, what the hell's going on now? But yeah. no, she's just crying. No, <laughs> it got you again. It got you again. That's the magic trick. And then, you know, we only get to see uh, a minute of their hour conversation, or however long it was. But most of it was dominated by like, you touched my boobs. He's like, yeah, only once. And we as the audience, like, bullshit. We want to go through time and yell at him. You know. That's, that's, I mean, it's just universal great writing. It was really good. That, that's going to be funny. You think this, this, you dub it to any culture in, a, in the world, they're going, <laughs> they're going to love it, you know? <laughs> is that a foreign laugh? Yes, it's my foreign laugh. I don't know where it's from, but it is. <laughs> <laughs> I wonder if the, uh, the burning of the, the shrine or whatever it was they were talking about was related to, the great like, fire. Yeah, the Great Fire thing, right? Like, it was Maori's Great Fire or whatever. Mm -hmm. They uh, named after him, right? That whole thing. Mayagoro's Fire. Like, yeah. could there have been a thing where, like, you know, you had the grandmother saying that she used to have dreams and you know, the daughter used to have dreams, or her mom or whatever. Like, whoever set the fire, I wonder if there was maybe a dream thing and maybe whoever set the fire wasn't the person yeah. that set the fire. Maybe. You know what I mean? Like, like, similar to this kind of thing of, like, you didn't seem like yourself yesterday and all that kind of stuff. What if that's what yeah. happened there and it's a similar kind of and it kind of seeds a little maybe. bit back there, and you get, oh, that, that, maybe this happened in the history. I didn't have to watch it again. To find maybe out. this happened to literally a thousand different couples, uh, you know, during the time of the comet, you know? Yeah. I don't know. Well, I also wonder if, was there a prophecy that, oh, we're doing all these rituals because there's a comet that's going to come in the year 2018 or 2016 or whatever. Yeah, and they, like, they did the picture of the comet coming before in the cave wall. Trying to warn them, but it was all burnt up. So. Yeah, that may have been from the first comment too. They, there was also the line in the beginning of the movie when they were like, "I don't know all that occult stuff they're getting into." Being like, "Yeah, they do some weird things. No one really knows what it is. It's tradition. Those keep going, you know." So just like hiding the idea that eh, like, it's they don't weird, even know why they do it anymore. Yeah. They lost the history. I just thought, so. like you know, she's like in the beginning. She's like, "Like I hate this town. I wish it was gone." <laughs> You know, very, I hate this very town. different movie. <laughs> True. I so, wish I was a boy in Tokyo. <laughs> I wonder if the mayor was the man that the mother traded with. Yeah. Well, that, yeah, that's what I said. It's like, what if this happened to her mom? Well, we know what happened to the mom, and we know what happened to the girl. Well, yeah, but what if like they met because of it? Yeah. And they just didn't understand exactly what was going on because well, that's wasn't a the, comment. Yeah, that's the thing. They have no idea of knowing because once it resolves, like like even with these two, we don't know that they'll ever remember. Yeah. The, the grandma was like, yeah, I had weird dreams. I can't remember anything. It could have worked out or it could have not. But the grandma and also the dad all rec kind of recognize this like, who are you? You are not that you person. Know, like, yeah. 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 You're not you. Mm -hmm. And maybe that's what finally convinced the dad because he knew about what happened with his wife, you know, his wife had strange dreams. Couldn't Maybe. understand. Maybe she like personalities changed and stuff. Maybe because he he. But he I only got actually convinced once it was her there. Yeah. Because yeah. uh, Taki, yeah. he didn't tried. Seem, he didn't seem to believe Taki. I mean, also like at that point, a meteor was crashing down to the earth. Yeah. You know, uh, I told you it was coming, Dad! It's right there! You're right! Get back to the school now! Go, run, run! <laughs> Carry your grandmothers. So they called a, <laughs> yeah. so they called a, uh, a public safety drill to get everybody out of there. And most of the people survived. Yeah. Which, I mean, technically last time most of the people survived. Only and one third of the people were killed. And they said it was a, it was, there could have been a scandal and conspiracies and yeah. how did he well, know? Well, that's because, and... like, how did he know that the meteor was going to land? You know, all the experts were saying it was going to burn up in Earth's atmosphere. Well, so, I mean, it's not just that. I mean, they were saying, like, oh, wow, look at this. this there's is... explosions and... Well, no, they were saying, wow, look at this. Like, it, it's, it's, this is unprecedented. No yeah. one could have predicted this kind of thing happening. And, yeah. You know? But then, but then, 
No conspiracy. Yeah. yeah. He didn't go and he didn't send astronauts to drill the comet and <laughs> blow part of it up over his town. Don't jack about drilling. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. You know, I mean, like, conspiracy doesn't mean to create it, mm. but knowledge of things going yeah. on behind the scenes. You didn't yeah. tell anybody or something. Yeah, like but that. the newspaper was like, what? Was, shoot, what was it called? It was. It, it had his name and it made it sound like he had some something to hide. You know. Mm-hmm. And, well, he had previous knowledge of it, so they're they're insinuating that. That he's separate? Like, no, that he purposely didn't tell anybody or yeah. didn't want to tell anybody. How do you get knowledge of a comet splitting? Hey, man, Christopher Columbus did it to the to those, those, nat- those natives, all right? They, yeah. he, no, he did not say a he comet. He promised the blood moon here. would come. Destroy Give me your stuff. food. And, and, and we it can, did. He took that. your hands. That's just science. So I, I think the real question that this movie asks is, do we all trust each other to blow things up if one of us says... Meteor's coming. If you say the code word. <laughs> the code word. The code Each word. of us have our own code word. But that means that we'd have to travel back in time in order to tell ourselves. I what know. if it was... I know, so I'll just wait until I know what the code word is, and then I'll, I'll know it when I hear it. <laughs> <laughs> I'll be like, ah! Fucking boobies! That's the code word? That's too common. So much stuff would blow up. Yeah. You'd okay. everything be blown up. Well, I can't say it in front of people. They'll, they'll mess with me. Yeah, you're right. Yeah, because they'll be like a wave con and be like, hey, Eric, Oklahoma. I'll be like, let's do this. You know? <laughs> exactly. I got a hell of a wave con. You run yeah. up the mountains, start blowing stuff up. <laughs> Wildfires run. Uh, Oklahoma's coming. Yeah, right? Harmer is going to slide into the river. I, I just wanted to, to look up, like, if there was any interesting trivia about the movie, because that's one of my favorite things to do after I've watched a new movie. It's like, I'm going to look up the trivia or something. So there's a couple cool things in here. Uh, the Red Braided Cord that uh, Michua... Uh, wears represents the invisible red string of fate that is said to connect someone to their fated person, which is according to Japanese tradition. So it's maybe something that we don't get is that that's like a common tradition in Japan that the the red cord is uh, it goes to your fated person. So that's interesting. Yeah, I'm not familiar with that one. That's why they call it the uh, the oh was it in uh, Demon Slayer hmm. the opening yeah string. Well, and those strands that were on the trees in that one scene, those are look very similar to the ones that the Yokozunas wear when mm-hmm. they do like their purification rituals yeah. at the beginning of the Bashos. Um, the meteor in the film is named Tiamat, 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 Tiamat after the dragon. ancient Mesopotamian goddess of the ocean. Oh, yeah. It represents female beauty creation and primordial chaos. Dungeon Dragons is a three-headed dragon. Dragon. Of evil. Yeah, that's what I thought. They said it a few times, and at one point, I, I, I saw Rick be like, damn it. He wrote it down. <laughs> I'm like, yeah. you missed it the first few times. Writer-director <laughs> Makoto Shinke personally found the film to be incomplete, unbalanced due to time and budget constraints. He wasn't happy with it. I loved it. I thought it was I thought fantastic. it was good. <laughs> I, thought, I thought what I saw was like someone's perfect artistic like vision. I, w- I was saying in the very beginning, I was like, Man, this shit doesn't happen in the West. They tell you why these yeah. people are switching spaces and all this kind of shit. Yeah. You know, I'm thinking Freaky Friday. Yeah. You don't just start and Lindsay Lohan's like, why am I in a body? I don't know. You know, it's like. Yeah, most American movies hold your hand. Yeah. Mm-hmm. There's a few that don't. It happens something. You know, Memento. Sure. Starts off a little differently. Yeah. Well, I have one last piece of trivia. This is pretty cool. We're going to love this. So. I better. In the scene where. Uh, Mishuaha? Mishuaha? Huh? Mitsuha. Mitsuha. Mitsuha and her friends are planning their action uh, with town's early warning system. Uh, on the desk, there is a rare and old, sold exclusively in Japan, home computer present. A sharp X68000. This is the same characteristic computer used by Daru in Steins Gate, a ah! famous anime also about time travel. That's cool. That's great. Isn't that great? That's great. So that look us up. Guys, I hope you enjoyed this reaction to your name. We very much enjoyed it, and I would never have known that this movie existed without people uh, over there at Patreon and uh, under this video telling what movies they want us to watch one day. So always do that. We'll uh, keep our uh, ears and eyes open here for me. And uh, make sure you can go over and vote over at patreon.com slash blindwave for the next one. Matoni for years.